I found some new and amazing fonts that will slide perfectly into your graphic design projects. Now first up, a bold and a modern sans serif typeface, Hanson. Hanson comes for free in the form of Hanson Bold, and it's a strong, modern and trendy font. Now this would work really great for posters, Factor One titles for websites, and importantly this would work really well for social media marketing, depending on who your target audience is of course. One real life example would be the more urban clothing brand Boohoo, as they do typically use these kind of typefaces in the marketing. But do you fancy something a little more unconventional? Yes. DT random display will actually for sure add a quirky touch to your graphic designs. This one would work really well on posters, possibly as a focal point or something along these lines. And sponsoring today's video is an absolute must for graphic designers. It's where you can download over 55 million resources in Vato Elements. Learn more about that later in today's video. I can actually imagine using this one on urban posters or posters aimed at the younger generations. Random display does seem like that kind of font you'd use on a brutalist or anti-design type of project. Senilita is a typeface that seems to have a logo design theory incorporated into the construction process. If you take a look at the curved form on the A and the N, it appears like circular grids have been applied to this font creation. Senilita would be awesome again for posters and websites, and it could actually come across as slightly retro. This one might be difficult to use on more modern designs or ones trying to target more serious audiences, and that's due to its kind of playful nature. Next up, a lovely typeface that has many, many uses. Canava Grotesque, and that's not to be confused with the design tool Canva, is a very clean and minimal sans serif typeface. Now it can be easily used for body text on websites, and it can be used across main logo type and also taglines, as well as headings or titles for designs too. It's available in both regular and italics, and it isn't that bold. Considering it's not that bold and thick, it should be used on designs that are not trying to make a loud impact. For example, this would be really good for modern and exclusive fashion brands, and that goes for the logo and also the branding. Uncut Sans is quite similar to the previous example, but this typeface comes in 8 different options and it's a little less serious in appearance. Uncut Sans is quite reminiscent of something like Helvetica, and if you take that into consideration, you'd look to use this for design projects where you want to communicate modern and forward-thinking messages, or a design that requires a clean and a simple typography solution. If you're asking me, I really like this one on body text as well. The next typeface is something that I for sure cannot pronounce properly, but hey, I'm going to give it my best shot. Tiro Gumaki. This gem of a typeface is one of the newest options that you can download from Google Fonts. It's a very clean and elegant serif typeface, available in italic and regular. This one obviously would work well on designs that are serious, or designs where you just want to send a message of luxury and importance. Things that spring to mind could be things like perfume branding, possibly financial sector branding, or just body text for magazines, but of course the titles as well. The letter forms on this are so well crafted, it's a serif typeface that you'd be happy to own as a graphic designer. And I personally really like the ball terminals on the number 3 and 5, something that really adds an elegant touch. And we're now heading back into the more trendy and modern zones with Gems Buck Black. This font is really quite stretched out, and it does make a big presence. It would work really well on sci-fi designs, urban designs, and again, kind of any marketing aimed at those younger generations out there. There's also a thinner version of this typeface. Out of today's gems, which ones are going to find their way into your font library? You can find them all linked in the description box below. So yeah, thanks to the sponsor of today's video, Envato Elements. This is a great one-stop shop subscription service that I use personally on a daily basis. Now as you can see here, they've added over 94,000 new assets this week alone. And there are over a quarter of a million motion graphics downloads. You can find a wide range of categories to look over such as video, imagery, templates, and even fonts as you can see here. And let me tell you, the font selection on Envato Elements is vast and awesome. 
but yeah you can also find things like website design templates and app design templates too and you're never going to run into trouble either because you own the rights to each download due to having a license when signing up for a paid subscription and it works out to be less than $20 a month for the annual plan and when you consider how useful this website is and how many downloads there are it does work out to be really cost effective and yeah you can check out Invato Elements linked down in the description box below but if you want to get more free fonts just click a video on screen and until next time design your future today peace